All right, these two familiar faces for the Etiwanda Eagle fans are here. Standing next to me, I have... Deron Scott from Cal Poly Pomona. And? Byron Wesley, USC. You guys came here tonight to see the playoffs, uh, round one. Uh, you had an opportunity to play for Coach, I guess you call him Coach K here as well. You have a Coach K where you're at. Tell me, uh, tell everyone at home that's watching this uh, what it's like to be uh, under Coach K here at Etiwanda. Uh... Fleck, uh, he prepared me for uh, for the for the for the uh, you know the, the next level at the college level. Uh, he was on on me tough, you know, through all my my years. And even when Byron transferred, he was he was on his tough. But he he meant he had us mentally like prepared, you know, even even uh, game wise uh, ready, you know, to compete at the next level. He, he had us prepared in, in, in all in all ways. And uh, tell me, as far as Coach K's influence for you, and some of maybe the things you've taken with you to USC. Uh, probably one of the biggest things I've taken was defense. You know, Click preaches defense, and that's that's basically what got me on the court at the next level. So I thank Click for that. Click's done a real good job of building a relationship with us. So I'm just I'm just a huge supporter of Coach Click and what he's done. Speaking of supporters, this gymnasium was off the hook. Everyone getting involved with it. You're here as a fan as well. Tell me, as a player though, playing in here and even where you play at, when you get a fan base like this to root behind you, what it does for you. Well, I, I mean, I, I came, I was watching, I grew up watching Darren, uh, my eighth grade year at, at EIS. So I, I always liked the atmosphere. I love the atmosphere. So I, I played here all four years. I, I, when I grew up, I, I, I knew I wanted to come to Atawanda and play just because of the atmosphere, and it was so great, and they were the best, the number one program in, in the Empire. How about yourself? To add to that, I, I basically just agree with him. You know, coming back here brings so many memories. Student section's always been supportive ever since I, ever since I can remember. So it's just, it's just, it's, it's a great feeling just to be out here playing in front of all your, all your friends and family. Coming on to this campus again as former players, going on to the collegiate level and with the potential of going into the professionals, a lot of these youngsters here are looking at you as mentors and role models. What could you say to them uh, as they get ready to move on to the next level? Just work hard and listen to Click. He was on me when I was in high school and I used to, you know, I used to, I used to get under my skin and want to blow him off, but now that I really look back, he was always telling me the right thing, and he 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 mentally and 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 basketball wise had me prepare for the next level. So he will he, do the same for these young men too, right here. And I basically, I mean, just just keep working hard. That's that's really all you can do. If you put in the time, if you put in the work, it's gonna show. And if you just if you just keep working, follow what Kleck's saying, because Kleck knows what he's doing. He's been doing this for years. So basically, if you follow what Kleck says, he'll 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 prepare you. So definitely proof of two young men who are now moving on to the collegiate level, possibly into the professional level, showing the family atmosphere and the bond here at Etiwanda High School. For SportsCTV.net, I'm Anthony Serenana.